Hi everyone, it's Melinda and I am back to talk about hair extensions, this time from a different brand. Um, just so you know, I did receive these hair extensions for free to do a review on, but it does not in any way change my honest opinion. If I don't like the hair extensions, I will swear to God, be honest with you because I don't want you guys wasting your money for like, you know, I don't want you to go out there thinking that you're going to get good quality products, spend the money and then realize, oh my God, she's such a liar. She said it was good. It's really shit. Okay. So I don't want you thinking that. I did an, a hair extension review um, five months ago about these eBay hair extensions that I bought. Um, and it wasn't really a good review, so I don't know why a lot of you girls were like, oh, uh, I'm going to go out and buy it now, blah, blah, blah. There were like a lot of bad facts in there that I stated, but I probably made it sound good. I don't know. But first of all, those hair extensions, when I bought them, I'm going to quickly show you guys. I think I bought Chestnut Brown, and Chestnut Brown was my hair color at the time. But when I got it, it was really, really light. This is the color that it came. That... Oh, I look so much dark on camera at the moment, but it's that color there and they look pretty healthy on camera but if you saw it in reality, I've had them for only five months. They feel really dry. I use really good shampoo and conditioner. I use the brand Joko which is like almost $50 for one little bottle in the hair salons and it's very expensive shampoo. It you know has a lot of protein and everything in it. So I don't know why it's so dry and I use Moroccan oil on my hair extensions so don't say that I'm not using the right products for my hair because I am and I don't wash it like you know every day because the hair is not real so it doesn't have its own oils in there hence why it dries up so easily but I wash it at least two times a week when I use it um, a lot. If the ends are really dry and frizzy I just when I first opened the packet I noticed how frizzy it was and it still is frizzy to this day. The reason why I'm talking about the hair right now is because a lot of you girls ask me to do like an after, um, like sort of, you know, a review on the hair after I've applied it on and used it so many times and straight in and everything. Um, I actually love the hair for curls because it holds the curls in until the next day um, and it straightens really well as well. But when I first got them, I wasn't happy with it because the ends were too thin. It will be thick from here, and then when it gets to the ends, it's really thin. If you want to see a photo of what it looks like when I use the hair extensions as a ponytail, I'll post some videos up, some photos up, sorry, and the video of how to do it will be in the down bar. But yeah, it's only great for making a false long ponytail hairstyle. Apart from that, I really don't like these. It's dry, it tangles really easily. When it's in a high ponytail and I'm going off to work, it tangles, like not even within five minutes, it tangles and I have to bring a comb with me all the time. And I know what you're gonna say about these hair extensions, you know, they're from eBay, what do you expect? The quality is going to be crap, yada yada yada. I bought, per uh, I purchased um, hair extensions from eBay like five years ago for my graduation and I've had those ones for like up to two, three years. And I literally could use them for that long because no matter what I did to it, it just didn't damage. It was so good and it was from eBay for $90 and I loved it. When I went to go back to buy the same hair extensions from the seller on eBay, they left. I couldn't find them anymore. No matter what I searched up on eBay, I could not find the same hair extensions again. So I'm so disappointed. I don't know where the seller went, but they sold their hair extensions for dead cheap. And the quality of the hair was amazing. Um, so, God, I'm so disappointed. But yeah, that's my review on the hair extensions. And oh, the clips. I had to actually purchase clips from eBay. These ones kept coming off. I don't know if it's the rubber in there, but the actual clip kept coming off my hair. If I had the hair extensions in my hair throughout the day, it'd come off. I have to go out and buy these ones here. See how these ones go straight down and these ones have that nice curve. I don't know if you can see that there. It's so blurry. I'm so sorry. See how it's curving and these ones are straight? The hair actually holds in these little curvy parts of the clip 
and it stays on all day it doesn't go anywhere with these ones once the hair is in it just goes straight out because the the clip bit thing is straight so it came in a box like that everything is really well packaged um, I'm gonna take out the hair because I know you all are excited to see the hair and I'm gonna pack it like that and I've got two so she gave me 100 grams of Indian Remy hair and they are 22 inches in the color number two so it's dark brown and it's the same color as my hair so I'm really satisfied with the hair because it's the same color as my hair like I don't have to go out and dye it or anything it's really good to know that they've got a huge variety of colors in their store it's really soft I can't stop playing with it right now I'm so happy with the quality. I emailed Kelly straight away letting her know how happy I was with the hair and there's no frizziness to it. It feels so, so soft and sleek. They, um, they have like a wide range of hair extensions depending on how long you want it as well. I think the 22 inch with the clip-ins were like um, 200 dollars, 210 around there. I'm gonna let you all know that I contacted her straight away last night, letting her know how happy I was with the hair extensions. I was like, damn, I'm gonna have to purchase these myself to do a giveaway for my viewers. I'll let you know when can you, instead of me purchasing it from them, having them send it to my address and then me sending it to your address, I was like to them, can you guys send it to the winner's address for me if I make the purchase? And then she goes to me, oh, um, Tell me when you want to do a giveaway because I'll supply the hair for you. And I was like, oh my god, that is so kind of her. Like, she is actually going to go out there and supply you guys, a one winner of course, with hair extensions of your choice. Like, can it, like, can the company get any more generous? I live all the way in California and they're helping me out by giving me free hair extensions to review, um, free hair extensions for you guys. And I'm like, so appreciative of all this generosity like there are so many kind people out there and i'm so happy to know that um you know i'll be able to do a giveaway for you all because the hair is amazing it feels amazing so i'm gonna pop it in for you guys all to see and so i've got a hundred grams so there's two packs there and you can straighten you can curl you can style it however you want because it is um remy hair and it's real hair it's quite long, isn't it? Put it up. So there's my head there. And it comes all the way up to my boobs. But because I'm going to have it down from my ear first, it's going to be that long. She gave me a bunch of business cards as well, in case I wanted to give it up to my clients when I do makeup or something like that. It came in this cute little bag. So I got a pen with it, and it's a Princess Hair Shop pen. Um, and then I got like a lip balm. And if you guys watch my videos, I actually am a fan of lip balms because my lips are always dry. They gave me like a few business cards, so they look like that. And I'm going to show you what they look like there. I am definitely going to give these to my clients and hand it out in the shoe shop if anyone sees me wearing my hair extensions because I think they're amazing. I had actually got and spent about $200 for my hair extensions. No more eBay shit. Seriously, I'm sorry if I swear a lot, but I'm just sick and tired of going on eBay trying to find the right hair extensions Then realizing it's not soft. It tangles too easily. The quality is really crappy It's not the right color yada 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 when I like find something that I really like I stick to it And I'm really liking these hair extensions So I have a feeling that I'm gonna be sticking with them for a while and I'd actually go out and purchase my own So I'm just gonna quickly show you The hair extension they gave me came with a little note, it goes, thank you Melinda from Kamisha. She's got the same writing as me, that is so funny. I used it last night and it's amazing. I have a GHD, so I'm going to be sharing this with my mom. She can change the temperature, how high or how low you want it. With a GHD, um, one factor that I don't like about it is that you can't change the temperature and my hair is really fine. And I talk about it in most of my videos, I tell you guys how bad it is for my hair because Every time I, I use the GHG, I notice my ends fry a lot. Like, I try not to leave the GHG on for too long so it's not too hot. I use heat protectant sprays and nothing works. So every time I do straighten my hair, I always trim it. Hence why I think my hair is growing a lot faster now as well because I trim it all the time. And I straighten my hair, like, I think twice a week. So I really like this hair straightener because you can 
uh, you, know, you can adjust the temperature up. If your hair is really fine and thin like me, you don't need a lot of heat. So I'm probably going to use a really, um, like I'm going to use minimal heat for my hair. That was there. She gave me that for free as well. It's so nice of her too. So one, one um, pack is 50 grams and 50 grams of hair, if I was to put it all in my head, you'd tell that I have hair extensions in because it's not enough. My hair is kind of thick at the top and thin at the bottom. So that's why I like to add a little bit more volume in my hair. So with these two, it actually look like my real hair. It won't look too thick or anything. And I can always go to the hairdressers and get them to cut it for me anyway. The first time I got my eBay ones, as soon as I did this to where I pulled my finger through the hair, I had a whole bunch of hair come out. So I wasn't happy about that. So much fallout, but this one has no fallout at all. And it's amazingly soft. Oh, I love it. This is a three way. Gonna show you what the clips look like. I know what you're gonna say, guys. Oh my god, Mel, you said that you didn't like clips that look like this because it looks similar to the ones that you got from eBay. And they do look similar. When I first got it, I thought to myself, no way, oh my god, they've got the same clips as my eBay ones, I'm not going to like them, yada yada yada, they're going to slip out, I have to talk, I have to talk to Kelly about it because, you know, I'm not going to hold in. When you open it up, there's a huge gap, can you see that one? That one's a huge gap, and that one's not. So I think that's the reason why, and the silicone's really slippery, so when I put it in my hair, it, easily, it comes out really easily, and I hate that, like it just comes out throughout the day. It's not coming out now because I teased my hair at the top. But yeah, these ones stay in all day. I tried it on last night as well just to... Let me put it on like, I don't know, the ends or something where it slips off the most. Oh my god, it's not coming off at all. How good is that? I'm gonna try this one. Yeah, that one's coming off. Definitely no. Amazing! This is the three weft hair extensions. These are two three weft ones. Three weft is just where it's got three clips in it, so that's a three weft. I've got two two wefts, so two clips on the hair. And then, oh, you've got three two wefts, so that's another one there with two clips. And you've got two one weft, so that's the individual. If you want to like put it near your fringe or something like that there. It's so soft. Part it from like the ear like that. And I bring it. Well I bring both my hands together. So that it's parted. I'm going to go ahead and use the three weft ones first. So I'm going to take this. And then, oh, by the way, with some hair extensions, you need to tease your hair. So you need to get a comb and tease it at the um, roots there. But with these, you don't. I already tried it last night. You don't have to tease it at all. And that's what I love about it. It holds. So I'm going to start from the corner here and clip it in like so. You can already see how nice the length is. Oh my god. So, I'm gonna wear this for the whole day and see how it goes and how it stays in the hair. And um, I'll be working today as well for eight hours, so we'll see how the hair goes and if it tangles and all that, and then I'll let you know. Just a little above where I clipped it last. I don't even think I'll be needing all these hair clips as well. And then I'm going to get the three wet again. I always use the ones with the most clips in first. And then I've got space for one more on the side, so I'm going to take the one wet and clip it just here. So far, it's looking really good. <laughs> it's 
it's so amazing you can already tell how much hair there is in there it's so nice it's the afternoon right now i'm starving guys i haven't eaten yet but i want to like quickly talk about the extensions before i finish the entire video off the hair has stayed on all day i had no problems with it at all i had a kid at work tug my hair because i do sell kids shoes um in my department as well tugged my hair and it didn't come out at all so that was awesome and I'm really happy with it like everyone's commented commented about how great the thickness is as well and if I have hair extensions or not because everyone knows that my hair is like this long so it looks really really natural anyways I'll see you soon bye